first of its kind educational game app, let's put it that way, Nick Academy, launched in Israel and provides game learning activities designed for age 6 to 12 kids. Now they've been developed in Israel, including a focus on the STEM subjects, that's science, technology, coding, mathematics, but here's a look at the app. Kids are incentivized to play and learn alongside characters from Nickelodeon's global hit, The Loud House. Kids are also able to customize their own personal avatars. The app is built around the gamification of education, so while kids play and progress, they also unlock rewards and new avatar skins. The app offers a wide range of topics and interactive experiences to explore and learn from. Kids can choose between multiple STEM subjects to create their own unique STEM curriculum. Explore the world of mathematics. Go to space and visit new worlds. Master the science of physics. Now joined in the studio by Neem Road Dweck, the CEO of Beta Gazella Ltd. And I, I, from just chatting with you briefly in the studio, I understand you've had a major role in, in, the, in developing this and getting it out there. And I was commenting as we're watching this, I have kids in that age bracket. It would uh, looks like something they'd love, to be honest. So tell us a bit about you know, how this Nick Academy app is a game changer, what's new, and, and tell us a bit more about it. So Nick Academy was a product uh, we developed in the past year. Well, we have all the COVID shutdowns in the background and how they roll. And we approached Nickelodeon and suggested them uh, to use the power of the brands to help kids learn. And, you know. They liked it. Nickelodeon yeah, liked it. Okay. Yeah, they loved it. <laughs> first of all, they've never done it in the past. Right. Uh, they had like some mild stuff they tried. But this was the first time ever they really took a brand, and a meaningful brand like The Loud House, which yeah. is one of the popular show, yeah. popular show by kids mm -hmm. everywhere. And... And he said, all right, let, let's give it a shot. Let's try it. Was it their idea to have it be Loud House? Or were there other shows that you were interested in? Or how did that come? We discussed it with them. Like our, our gut feeling was, you know, Dora the Explorer or SpongeBob okay. or something yeah. like that. My passion is to do it on Avatar The Last Airbender, actually. <laughs> okay. But uh, they said, no, the Loud House. The kids love it. It's, it's diverse. It shows a r wide range of characters. There's the, the, the sisters are smart. Like, they're powerful characters. So let so we roll with it. So there's this real Israeli side to this. I mean, so this is pushed forward by you, but I mean, explain to us how that Israeli side of the story in collaboration with Nickelodeon, um, you know. So there are a lot of players okay. that teamed up together. Uh, we have a great backwind by Udi Meiron, the head of uh, the fund that supports us. We approached the uh, uh, Davidson Institute, by the, which is the educational arm of, of Weizmann Mindset, which is the entrepreneurial fund of, of the Center for Educational Technologies, the Ramon Fund, Code Monkey, okay. and we suggested all of them to team up with us and create this product. So you have a very interesting platform that hosts a wide variety of games, giving months of gameplay for kids, where they can learn coding, they can learn mathematics, they can learn science and space. And, and what's really important about it, that honestly, if they learn STEM, it's one thing. But what we really wanted them to do is, is have fun and become better people in society. There, there is a, a program called the Compass Program by the OSTD, which details what skills kids these days need to become meaningful actors in society. And We've, well, playing these games, they learn about creativity and, you know, uh, learning from one subject and put it on the other subject. Uh, we have uh, the, what we call adventures, which are basically virtual escape rooms, where they have to really utilize the knowledge they have in order to progress. And I think this is the real game changer in, in such an app. Uh, I mean, I, I love what I'm hearing here, and I'm definitely going to be downloading this <laughs> for my own family. But the impact of COVID, we touched on this a bit, it feels like, and I think you're a part of this, that there's a new wave of tech innovation that's focused on improving the world, on education, on what's called tikkun olam in Israel, but these things that are you know, moving things forward, impacting in a positive way, looking to have a positive impact on the world. Is that something that sort of was new to you and sort of were you fueled by COVID to sort of get I, in on this? I entered the game industry about 11 years ago, and most of the game industry in Israel is a lot of casual games and hyper-casual and, and social casinos and stuff, and, and I pushed it away from me, and I said, if we are going to do games, let's fix the world. Let's make it a better place. Games can really change everything. And when COVID bro broke out everywhere, all of a sudden we have kids stuck to their screens and looking for meaningful education and entertainment. And, and parents, they're looking for it, but the parents, yeah, we're the looking for it. Exactly. Yes, yes, I am a parent, you're a parent. You know, you know, it's they are like, stuck to their screens, and you're right about that. Yeah, and, and we want them to have meaningful time that they actually learn something. So this was the opportunity for us. And what we've seen in the past year, and we did a lot of playtests, the, 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 Besides, the kids were super excited about it. 
the parents were excited about it <laughs> because they really got something meaningful I'm here. Excited. Yes. <laughs> Nimrod Dweck, it's exciting to meet you. I feel the energy, the positivity around this. I know it's probably going to the next things, your next projects here. Keep moving with that. Thanks for joining us uh, and telling us about the app here. So, well, Thank you so much for having us. Nick Academy. Uh, you can download it on the Play Store and App Store. Great.